So I just want to make a quick video before my first Feldenkrais and Alexander Technique uh, session, which I'm looking forward to. Um, I basically had to go back again to get my Atlas adjusted. That's for the sixth time to Newcastle. And also um, had another um, spinal network session in the in the city. Um, and I mean, it, the, the, the reason behind that is because uh, I was noticing that I would have the adjustment down, I'd feel really, really good. And then uh, I'd have the alpha at night, I'd wake it and uh, wake up in the morning and it was kind of all reverted back. So I thought, well, one night at least have, um, I did the Atlas adjustment again. And then I went to the spinal network practitioner, like the chiropractor on the same day and got um, that whole adjustment done with the alpha in. Um, and that's definitely seemed to help me get more used to that, get my body more used to the alpha, I'd say. Um, just to figure out where I'm going. Um, and uh, and another thing I did was I went down to Wollongong again for another round of uh, the prolotherapy. Uh, it's been like six or seven weeks since the last time, so I'm kind of counting this as round one. Um, the yeah, uh, like all these injections, you know, and the, my traps are still really really tight, and then my jaw and everything even up like up here, you know, my neck, yeah, all sorts. Of, and um, yeah, I definitely do. I definitely do like that. You get kind of an at least I found you get kind of an immediate, you know, release of it in, in a way. But yeah, I meant to try maybe three sessions at least before I can make a proper call out. And um, I mean, the practitioner said like, you know, he wouldn't be, have been doing it for 15 years if he didn't notice, if he wasn't noticing results. So, you know, I do trust him. Um, and the other thing I wanted to talk about was um, things like Lyrica and, and Gambestine. I'm not, I don't think I'm saying that right. Um, these things... I was reading more on what Jamie Kaufman um, says about reflux and stuff because again, you know, I mean, I woke up this morning, you know, white tongue, and you could literally see the mucus down the throat, and um, that was that's respiratory reflux and not um, post nasal drip like I was maybe thinking before. So you know, I was getting back on looking at reflux stuff, and um, she, I was reading a long article about you know that she wrote about the vagus nerve and and reflux and all this sort of stuff and. One of the things was um, saying that, you know, these are, when you have vocal cord issues, it's like a neurogenic thing. Um, so having these kind of drugs can, you know, basically be a cure, but I'm, I'm very, very ongoing of, you know, 4,000 milligrams or something like that. So <laughs> and I know you've got your way up, but that's some of the story she was saying. Maybe that's what I need, but, you know, I'll try to do other stuff first before. I get to that point. I also have to figure out if my GP can actually um, prescribe that. Yeah, we'll see. And I'll let you know how this session goes.